Well, were there rumors about the possible breakup between Young Miami and Didi? But well, yes, there was. Were there also rumors about Didi engaging himself in any, you know, gay parties? Well, yes, there was. And of course, were there rumors about Didi apparently being the ally of, uh, you know, Tupac's murder? Well, yes, there was. And there's still an investigation ongoing. But amidst all these, looks like Young Miami still is really in love, head of the heels with Didi. And of course, on his birthday, he did something shockingly uh, you know explosive on uh, you know social media and everyone is just left in you know i don't know what to say about this but diddy has apparently proven that well yes i still love my la i mean my wife regardless uh the horrendous stories or the headlines uh, i do see she loves me i love her and we still think uh, you know in a relationship together well guys find out exactly what diddy uh did for young miami on his birthday and i'm sure all of you out there really i uh, would appreciate the fact that well diddy sometimes you know deserve an applause so, well join today's episode this is the literary shopping acts news as usual if any comments uh will be appreciated inside the comment section join today's episode but before please do want to subscribe to our platform if you're new to this channel well you like and welcome join the family let's get into a broader conversation here now interesting conversations have gone on uh, on between these two uh young miami and didi i mean we have brought you lots of reports about didi involved in so many uh you know bruhaha you know conversation the recent one so far is the fact uh, is, is, is you know is the fact that he also has been linked or fingered as a suspect in uh you know the late uh rapper to Pax's murder and it's becoming very very controversial his you know a video did pop up some time back which of course did see how his demeanor was when he was being asked a question uh for those of you who did watch the breakfast show some time back when uh Charlemagne also was present at the broadcast program uh where he was asked about the whole thing he really looked very uncomfortable and people suspected or became very suspicious of the fact that well looks like because of his uncomfortable state well, it looks like he knows something about it. But amidst all of that, we also brought a report about Young Miami allegedly unfollowing, uh, you know, uh, Didi on Instagram because in the heat of this conversation, it looks like he was a, she was a bit petrified, you know, and very, I should say, uh mortified also about this conversation and so some people also allege that well since she was petrified at the same time and mortified she apparently wanted to disassociate herself from the conversation but guess what this is a surprising shock for all of us well didi gave or spent more than a million us dollars on uh you know young miami not just that he took her on a i mean a long trip vacation check this out and see what you know didi uh you know did to young miami well the jealous fans out there i'm sorry there's not going to be a break He's good yes for real. You need Just to get flowers while this. you are living and breathing. Monty and the whole crew. Uh, here's the card. Okay. I see you, Christian. Love, baby. Yeah, it's a balloon. Nah, nah, these beautiful for real. You need to get flowers while you are living and breathing. Monty and the whole crew. Elgin, Vicky, thank you. Let me see, Lorraine, thank you, my love. Dolce, Dolce, straight from Milano, love you. Yeah, I see you, love, love, baby girl. Dear Aaron, I love you guys. That's what I got myself for my birthday. A state-of-the-art gym. Shout out to my people over at Techno Gym. Be sure to like, comment, to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, I got this. This came from, um, so it's from Japan. It's right here, this is my hyperbaric chamber. Okay, be doing like an hour of that. Gotta love yourself. Nice woodway. Got my whole Pilates set up. You know, I gotta keep my legs strong. Pilates. Want to come over, baby, have a Pilates date? Yeah. Then I got my legs, got to keep the legs. I got my fans' legs coming in 2025. For all y'all that have requested it, this is rowing machine. It's not in, like, the right order right now, but it's, as you can see, you know, I mean, I mean. This just came in right on time. Thank you, MTV. Hey, yo, London, we on our way. Hey, yo, we did it, y'all. Thank you. 
So uh, that was uh, Young Miami and Didi over there. So uh, belated uh, birthday uh, to Didi. And I'm really happy with the fact that, you know, her wife, uh, his wife really seemed very positive around him. Well, so um, well, the, the criticisms will come. The, the social media conversations about whether or not Didi is this, is that, has been engaged in all of that will come. But for the fact that uh, a wife like Young Miami is always very positive and standing, I know, beside him is the fact or the part really that I'm really enthused about. And I feel like that's that side of their relationship really I know needs to be applauded. Well, congratulations to Didi also. Let's just um, celebrate him uh, for now. Let's not wait for uh, the unfortunate thing to happen before we come be shedding, uh, you know, fake or crocodile tears as though uh, he were uh, so magical, you know, uh, a human being. So uh, once again, belated birthday to Didi and spending one million. I mean, it's more than that. Too. A very, very huge amount of money. Hey, you guys, you're really, really chilling, you know. It's not it's not easy. That's that's a whole lot of money we're talking about, like one million US dollars just on a birthday party. I'm just imagining what really, uh, you know, some of the goodies or the groceries that also went beside uh, or came along uh, with this interesting, uh, you know, birthday. This is the most wildest uh, birthday I've seen so far. Uh, it, it was not even about Young Miami. It was supposed to have been about Didi, but he made it look uh, more like, you know, uh, it was Young Miami that was celebrating her birthday. And I cannot wait to see uh, what exactly he would do for Young Miami. Well, this time also, I think Young Miami should do something for Didi. I, I don't know why women are always taking, taking, taking. Well, even on uh, Didi's birthday, he, he was given to... Oh, women, you can never understand women. I mean, <laughs> let us know what you think about it uh, inside the comment section. But once again, congratulations to uh, Didi. And we say that we love you. Yes, keep keep giving us some things to talk about, even though uh, it's always been the negative. But of course, negativity, they say, sells. But sometimes when it's very positive like this, uh, we are up to, uh, I mean, we will uh, propagate uh, the, the positive also. So it's not just about the negatives. When it comes, we will talk about it. You guys get it? So let's once again uh, check out some interesting visuals once again. This is where we're up on today's episode thanks for watching oh here's the card okay i see you christian love baby it's a balloon nah nah these are beautiful for real you need to get flowers while you are living and breathing monty and the whole crew elgin vicky thank you let me see lorraine thank you my love Dolce, Dolce, straight from Milano. Love you. Yeah, I see you. Love, love, baby girl. Dear Aaron, I love you guys. That's what I got myself for my birthday. A state-of-the-art gym. Shout-out to my people over at Techno Gym. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. I got this. This came from, um, this was from Japan. This right here, this is my hyperbaric chamber. Okay, be doing like an hour of that. Gotta love yourself. Nice woodway. Got my whole Pilates set up. You know, I gotta keep my legs strong. Pilates. Wanna come over, baby, have a Pilates date? Yeah. And I got my legs.